Hey everybody, KC here. So I want to circle back on something today, uh, to something that Indra Nooyi, the former CEO and chairman of PepsiCo, uh, said during our recent conversation here on Morning Newsbeat and connected to something that Vivek Sankaran, the uh, CEO of Albertson, said to me a couple of months ago when we were doing our conversation on Morning Newsbeat. And I connected it during uh, the New Year conversation, but I want to underline it because I think it's really important. Um, one of the things that Vivek said to me back a couple of months ago was that when his first job out of school, he was living in India, uh, was raised there, his first job out of school was he would go to these little pop-up stores that were on the side of the road in India, and he was selling these proprietors ink for their printers, because basically that's where people went if they needed to have anything printed or copied, right? But he realized pretty quickly that he wasn't really just selling ink, that he was playing a role in their ability to, to achieve their livelihoods, that if he didn't make sure they had the ink when they needed the ink, they wouldn't be able to do their work, they would not be able to feed their families, they wouldn't be able to clothe their families, pay their rent, all that sort of thing. So it wasn't just about selling ink, it was about something much larger. And Indra Nui, also raised in India, had a very similar story. She talked about her first job out of school in India being selling uh, thread to tailors. But uh, they would make these ma uh, madras shirts and pants and jackets. And she said, no, nah, but she realized pretty quickly she wasn't just selling thread. Because if she didn't make sure that the tailors got exactly the thread they needed, they couldn't do their jobs and couldn't achieve their livelihoods. And in fact, in their case, they were able to make these garments that would have enormous meaning to the people who bought them. So both Vivek and Indra, they saw the supply chain in a much larger sense than just their, their particular roles in it. And I think that's a really important um, observation that more people need to think about, especially in retail. If you're in the supermarket business, you're working in a supermarket, yeah, you're selling food, but you're also providing ways for people to nourish their families, to have family dinners in, in which the children who are there are able to have, uh, they're better adjusted, they have better grades, they have less likelihood to be involved with alcohol and drugs. There's a much something much, something much larger going on there. And I think it's really important if you're in the business to think of it that way. Um, I thought it was fascinating that both Indra and Vivek uh, came had this observation, and I think it ties into something uh, that people in the retail business, especially the food retail business, need to think about. You know, back when I was an actor, before I got involved in this gig, there's an old phrase that people like to use. There's, there's no such thing as small roles, there are only small actors. And in some ways, I think that applies, right? No matter what you're doing, if you only think of it as having a small role, okay, it's the, you're, you're going to underestimate your ability to deliver something that's much larger, something of much greater value. It's the difference between having a transactional relationship and having a relationship that goes beyond that, that has much greater meaning. So I thank both Indra and Vivek for, uh, for making those observations, and I'm glad I could share them again with you today. Anyway, that's what's on my mind this morning, and as always, I want to hear what's on your mind.